Hey guys, welcome to Toxic Lady Logic Talks. I'm your host, So True, and joining me as, as always is Pops. What's going on, guys? And let me introduce you to the local music producer over here, promoter, whatever you want to call him. <laughs> Loudmouth. <laughs> Loudmouth. <laughs> Dave good. Bailos. Dave so. Bailos, that's close. Good deal. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> hey, I've been called worse by better people. <laughs> All right, there we go. But hey, let's fucking rock on. <laughs> Right. So how's it going? Doing wonderful. Doing oh. good. Pleasure to be here with you guys. Looking forward to it. Glad you could make it, bud. Thank I you, mean, my friend. We, um, you. I, everywhere we go, we see you at one of our shows, you know, or, you know, we see you on Facebook popping up at every yep. karaoke event and everything going on. Yeah. I um, love music, brother. Let, let's give them some, uh, give everybody a little background. This is the founder of Dave's Sports Center Correct. slash bar. Back in 93, I got opened up. It was going to be basically a billiard parlor, and then it got transitioned into more or less Dave's Sports Center, where I gave a venue for the local bands to play. Right. And uh, my love of music moved from the billiard parlor to where it needed to be in the music and that's what i love and promoting all the awesome talent that's right around us here albany georgia I, area there's so much local there, talent. there really is so I, many good bands out there yes, yeah yeah i mean we, we we got a lot of new talent um right uh back then you were probably about the only guy keeping the local scene going i, I huh? gave them a chance and a spot a venue to where they could express their talents and get it out there to the public to hear and and it was great i mean it worked it was a working relationship with the local guys and that's what you got to take care of is the people that are around you the people that you see every day and listen to what they've got to offer and they just want to express themselves that's one thing about musicians that i love yeah, you got to have money to live, but they would rather play to a group that loves them and they can get the energy off of than, than the money. I mean, the money, yes, it's nice. I'm not going to say it's not because we all need money to live. But you just won't have somebody to accept your talent and, and listen to what you have to offer. You know, and that's what I love about it because I get, I feed off of y'all's music. When you play, right. I'm just like getting yeah. energy and it's like... Yeah, yeah, let's go. The energy is a thing I, I yeah. hit on a lot of You're times. You're on the technical end uh, of it. I, yeah. So you see that as well. Yeah. yeah, I love energy. So energy in a bar or somewhere, wherever yeah. you're playing. Yeah, positive it, energy. Like positive energy. This like, town is full of negative energy. Oh, I hate yeah, to bring yeah. up that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So we have to escape into no. the music, and that's right. where we get the positive. Like when, positive you, when, when you get that feedback, and they're getting up, clapping, yeah. Yeah. and dancing, yeah. and yeah. 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 all that. That's when it gets exciting. Oh, yeah. Well, I appreciate and, what y'all offer, the right. music. Well, yeah. I mean, if you're a musician, if you ain't got a smile on your face and you're right. trying to interact with the other people out Correct. there in the crowd, you know. Correct. I mean, it's not just a band playing. Yeah. There's a crowd. There's, it, yeah. it doesn't matter if there's three people there. That's right. You, you got to interact with yeah, them. Yeah, showing know, the you know? love, showing the love. And yep. I, I, I love, I've loved playing every show I ever played. Good. Good. Honestly, what? Why else do it? Yeah. You know, why else would you do it? Yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. Um. Yeah. So, in you got, uh, I bet you you got some stories. Man, uh, tell, some tell, of them I can't even tell on uh, this. <laughs> oh, wait, Dude, wait, hold wait, on. Wait, 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 wait. That's what you told Oh, is this why I don't? Wait, wait. We want all the juice on all of them. Uh, hey, hold on. You, you tell me what avenue you want to go you, down. You told me um <laughs> when we're at the the bar Last the day. other day you yes. told me about brandon fox okay okay let's start with brandon because he's kind of like a family to me he was 15 years old when he got started he played in my bar at 15 i knew automatically he was uh, a phenomenal talent uh he was in a little band they played at dave's quite a while uh i've had bands like shiloh earl slagle that band played there quite a bit uh dennis duke and his band mark blanchard they were there Troy Walker, I got to mention Troy, my buddy. He was actually one of the first bands that played there. I think it was uh, Midnight Rain or something. These are young boys when they're like in their right, 16, right. 17, 18, 20, you know, something like that. They were able to play in there and gave them a venue. And, you know, and families were made out of Dave's Sports Bar. I don't know if right. it happened there. <laughs> it actually no. started there. They met their girlfriends, got married, no. had kids. So, you know, that part of it's a, a nice story. So, 
I, I really wish I was around back then. Yeah. Because I would have grew up with all of them guys oh, yeah. right then. Because, yeah, yeah. Because I, I, I didn't get here till later, and um, I wasn't in that scene. But so I learned yesterday, just yesterday, that Troy Walker right. used to be a guitar player. Absolutely. Lead and, guitar for, for many different years or whatever. And then he got with Rock Candy, and they asked him to learn the bass. He finally came over to the dark side. Yeah. <laughs> Bass players. Come on. Stay with us. Troy, Troy, we're giving you some props here, brother. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> but he can play lead and bass. That, he had that, to learn so the bass. Cool. For rock cool. candy. Yeah. yeah. I mean, a little history about him is he learned the guitar first. Okay. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I, that's what I think all bass players are like. We're, we're going to play guitar. Yeah. But then we figure out, well, everybody needs a bass player. Sure. Yeah. You know? And that's that's the backbone with you and the drummer is the backbone for music. Yeah, exactly. Really if you is. don't have a bass and a drummer, the rest so, of it don't matter. I don't care how good the lead singer is and the lead guitarist. If you I'm don't have the you rhythm and that. timing. If I ever need a guitar player, <laughs> right. I'm going to call Troy. Yeah, he can play. <laughs> hey, and he's available right now. But so so the crazy thing, what you just said is yeah. that a bass player and a drummer is like main components. It's fine. Are, That's the foundation. It, yeah. uh, yes. It, no singer, doubt. Singer could be great. Yes. You know, if yes. he can do acapella, awesome yeah, and all right, that. Right, right, correct. But when it comes to making the music a whole, yep. like one of their shows, they were missing something. I couldn't quite get it yeah. you know learning trying to learn the sound still right but then i i, I turned up his bass just a touch yeah. and it was like boom gold. magic yeah the yeah. magic just yeah. happened yeah. it's like yeah. building a house if you do not have a foundation you have nothing hold on <laughs> <laughs> i don't try to turn him up too much enough. i can't do that what <laughs> <laughs> i love it i love it and i gotta say this one time it is a pleasure the father and son combo here the room that you've got this this facility yeah. uh thanks again for having me and inviting not, me not a problem. Yeah, not I, a mean, problem. I mean, not I a mean problem. fun stuff good yeah, yeah. stuff. so good we stuff. have to point out yes we have to point out that yes. you are the first non-drinker we've had oh yeah show. budweiser um, zero i don't know where the camera and, is somewhere over here yeah. uh <laughs> 10 years ago i quit drinking and doing drugs i used to be the biggest drunk and probably i don't just want to say well, that, drug that's addict, why we I, asked him I, yeah 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 but I, clean 10 years thanks to god in heaven i asked him to take the desire away i drank my bud zeros because i love the taste of beer and I, I love to socialize with my friends, and uh, I like to sing. I sing four nights a week karaoke all over Albany. You may have seen me out at Lee Pub every Sunday night. I'll do a little plug for them. But uh, I just I enjoy singing. I love music. I love live music. Uh, last night, as a matter of fact, I was in Macon for the uh, Led Zeppelin tribute band. They were phenomenal. Albany has been having some good venues here lately, but we need more of that. We need more of the local guys to be lifted up because the talent in Albany, Georgia, and the area is just as good as anything anywhere in the United States of America. I'll say that right now. Y'all no, got it. The talent's here. No, there there is plenty of talent. Plenty talent. overflow and of talent just right not, here. Uh, they don't appreciate it. You guys wake up and understand what's going on. Come out to these venues. Pay attention on Facebook. When they list it, get out of your house. Come out I mean, and, yeah. and listen. You I, know, the talent's there. It's, it, it's, it's yeah. such a fun time. Too. It really is a fun I time. Mean, we, yeah. should really, we should really go ahead and call out the few places in the Albany, Tifton area that, yep. that, uh, that support the local talent. Right. And they want to put it out. Want to promote and it. I, and I don't want to just say the rock band thing because – Rock is big. People like rock. We There's love country. it. There's country. There's country out there. Energy. But Lee Pub. Yep. Thank woo, you, Lee thank Pub. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Yep. Um, Harvest Moon. They, yep. They thank promote. you, Harvest Moon. Bo Henry. Harvest thank you. Moon. Yeah. And, uh, you know, you want to... Uh, we play a lot at the, the Little Whiskey. Little Whiskey will put some music on. Yeah. Yep. Thank you, Little Whiskey. And That's right next door to where I work, Homes Plus. If you need a mobile home, Dave Bayless. Let me get this off. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> How you doing? Dave Bayless at Homes Plus. That's where I work. I've been there 20 years. We'll take care of you. The best prices in the state of Georgia, <laughs> guaranteed. <laughs> and I'm not like just it. saying that. You got, right. got a little We're advertisement not going to charge you much for that plug. But. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Yeah. Everybody's got a mobile <laughs> yeah. and, uh, so, and there's a few other places i'd like to you know the the lamp lighter pub down there in tifton i've been there great yeah. man the little stage but they, it's oh, a good man. spot yeah yeah it, i yeah. mean it's a crowd oh a back they yeah. flood in there yeah yeah yeah, yeah. 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 
I mean, so the, and we need more of those kind yeah. of places. But Electric we need junkyard, local support. That, that's another group. Oh yeah, yeah. I, like, I love those guys. I mean, yeah. we had them on the yeah. show. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. Jay Lawrence we, and, and Burroughs. Yeah. Well, we have Burroughs and Bill up here. Mm. Bill, see, yeah. so I used Nolan to be, Patrick. We love you. No, Nolan. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Yeah. So our name in Toxicated Logic. Yeah. There we go. Me and Bill and Mike. That's used a hell to have of a, a drummer. Band. Hell of a we drummer. We used to have a band called Intoxicated Logic. Wow. So that's we where took it. We no, three albums. Together. Nice, nice. And uh, we didn't take it. We asked Okay, them. yeah. We, we asked them for it. Okay. And right. our opening music is Intoxicated Logic. There's Mike Burroughs yeah, it's and a, Bill and me. Yeah. You know? Well, you know, and then there, of course, the song that plays I, mostly yeah. ain't me on it, but yeah. we got a lot of songs that yeah. is me. Well, Burroughs has I, got know. a versatile voice. Yeah, I play. Oh, he's so good. He, yeah. uh, Mike Burroughs, you are awesome. We'll go ahead and tell you. Yeah. He is good. Yeah, I mean, oh, that, he's that guy on this and, show. And Jay Lawrence on that guitar. Hello. Yeah, yeah we can't call Mike Burroughs. Uh, Bur- Mike Burroughs. It's that guy on the it's show. It's that guy. Oh, so that, guy. No, okay. that guy. That guy. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. That's that's, that's well, the rule. I'm with What's up, that guy? It's that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we couldn't. You know. Yeah. But yeah, the, apologize. I didn't know. The, I didn't know. The, the but Bill is the best drummer. He, he, yeah. No doubt. <laughs> that guy can bang. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, Brent. Sorry, Richard. Oh, Sorry, hey, hey, Brent Pipkin. How you doing? Yeah. They told me you were here ahead of me. You always Brent, get ahead of Brent me. Brent would never watch this. He <laughs> would never. He's a, he's a, he's a, he, if you want to know a, a dick, yeah. you know Brent. Oh, he's yeah. a fucking dick. <laughs> Asshole. Hey, but he wears it well. Yeah, yeah. He I, you know he's he not really going to hide does. behind anything. No, no, yeah. no. He has no facade, right? I, I just dare anybody to fucking call him out. I could call him and say they were talking bad about you on that podcast. She should watch that, Brent. <laughs> 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 and he uh, still wouldn't watch hey, well, it. Hey, hey, Brent's he don't care. He's gonna, he, he gonna be him. He man. don't yeah. care. Wow, but, flower. Yeah. He sang the hell out yeah. of that song. Oh yeah, yeah. We, yeah. So me and Brent had a few bands together. We were in Bob Wire, Barbed Wire, yeah, um, and we had a side project with Mike Little for a little while. Okay, Barbara Cornette was in other band. Oh yeah, 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 and uh, and Brent was the drummer in the, both those bands. Yeah, and yeah, man, we had a great run, a lot know. of fun, a lot, oh, yeah, God. yeah, yeah. We did. Me and Brent are like brothers. So Correct. Yeah. Back in back at the when we stopped playing together, me and Brent was like this. Yeah. We were button heads so yeah. bad. Yeah. But it was because of the the other people in the band that right. we were doing it. We loved each other, but yeah. we would we would talk each other about it. And, yeah. And you and know, work it out. Yeah. And like like man would, yeah. But um but yeah, you know. That's good. Good yeah. reminiscing yeah. about like I said, there's just the history Mike of Little music. Rest in peace. That dude could sing and anything. Yeah. Mm. Rest in peace. He, yes. he was a side project. Yes. And we, we got a video that's got like, you know, 20,000 hits on YouTube. Oh, yeah. 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 <coughs> but Mike He had Little a raw talent right yeah. now. He yeah. did have a raw talent. And, yeah. Yeah. Like I said, the history of music in this area that people don't even have a clue about because there's just not enough exposure is the only problem. But yeah. the, the raw talent that's through this area oh, is yeah. amazing. Yeah. Like, uh, beyond I'm, amazing. You know, like, and with. Like now, knowing you and stuff, I'm like I have actually done YouTube videos of '95 and stuff. Right. So there's videos of them out there. So you're just, you're trying to get the word out. That's the key. So thing. like trying yeah. to trying to get it out there so people know more about it, and then they can even watch a video and see what they're going to see. So let's see what these guys are talking about. Yeah. Right. Right. So, right. right. I'm with you. And um, right now I have a full uh, set list from a night that I need to go through. Yeah. You know, and edit the music so I can get it put out. Right, right, from, right, right. From the band because, of course, I record music when I do it live. So. Well, it's just like anything else. If there is no communication, there'll never be anything to work off of. So you're providing communication yeah. to the people to listen and what's going on. Right. Get out of your easy boy recliner come out and and check out these local bands and you'll see what we're talking about we're not just trying to hype something up there's no. a there's a lot of good talent out there and it's an enjoyable evening i mean yeah. you know live live shows are something to go see yes without um, a doubt. without you a can doubt. listen to it on the radio all day long not and never part. never get the true feeling right. of what it's like right. to be there right. Li- right. in a yeah. live setting yeah that live feeling is there yeah. yeah that's what it's all about yeah mm-hmm. i agree and that's that's kind of like i said when i had back to transition back to when i had the bar 
that was what I radiated. I tried it to provide a an event that felt like you were in your living room, but the band was playing there. I had live tribute bands come through town, uh, Kiss Army, Hell's Bells, Ozzy Osbourne tributes, on top of the local talent. Sometimes I would let the local talent open up for them so that they would get more exposure and it would just kind of work yeah. together. It's like a, a, a you know hand-in-hand yeah. kind of deal. And uh, we had great times, though, man. I, I can tell you so many stories, but back then I was drinking a case of beer a night, and I can't remember all the stories. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm clean now, mm. and part of my brain is still here, so that's why I'm here with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> it, that's all that matters. You're yeah. here now. Yeah, yeah. I mean, hey, you're, God ain't done with me. That's what I'll say. I should have been gone, but I'm not, so deal with it. Yeah. Right. <laughs> we we're all here. Still. Yes, sir. For a reason. reason, he's not done with us. He's yeah. not done with us. If you feel like that, that nothing's going your way, just seek out. I'm not trying to go all religious on you, but I, I am a man of faith. And if you've got problems going on, ask the man to help you. And if he, he he will hear you, he will hear you, and he'll get you through that little storm that you're going through, man. Yeah. And, and and it's all about love. Love one another. Treat people like you want to be treated, baby. That's yeah. it. That, that's it, man. That's how that's how simple it really is. We complicate life by the things that we do. So try to get out of your own way. If I can give any message, get out of mm-hmm. your own way. Yeah, there yeah, you go. That's it. And love. Love people, man. Yeah. yeah they, it don't man. hurt you to help somebody. Help somebody and, you know, lift them up. There don't beat go. them down. No. Yeah. Yeah. You know people in your life that love to talk people down to make themselves feel better? I can't stand people like that. If you're yeah. talking people down to make your light look bigger and brighter, oh, you're missing the boat. I, I, yeah. I can agree. Not, you feel me? You we're feel not going to call out those name callers. You know? Yeah, yeah, you know, but they're all out. They're out there. Yeah, they're out there. Yep, yep. All right, let's get back on. Hey, so, <laughs> so let me let me tell you guys something. We live in America, right? Yes. yes. This is America. Yes. And American Americans, we love. We are Americans. Yep. Um, and you know. There's other countries that think they're badass, and but other countries get invaded. Correct. People, yeah. people invade those countries. Right. You mm-hmm. know where the countries that have never been invaded? It's America. And why is that? I, I mean, you think about it. You think about that <laughs> shit. Come on, I want to hear your, y'all's of, opinion. I've thought every of. redneck has a gun and loves shooting it. Oh. <laughs> 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 You and we love a reason shit. to shoot it. You think we love- that, you know, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just say I myself have more rounds stored up for the weapons I have than I'll ever need. Oh, God, yes. I mean, uh, I will never need. Protect- I don't have no reason to have all the rounds I have. Protection is a good thing. But I'm going to just say yeah, no. if I need them, yeah. I got them. So yeah. just, and just- I'm not the only one. That's no, right. No. That's right. Just knowing right. so because I have friends around the world because my previous I was in the military. Okay. So I have friends. Uh, one of his dad has a, a garage, or and above the garage is his uh, loading area. Arsenal his, area. Yeah, yeah, he's got he's got probably ten thousand rounds. Nice. You know, up there, just chill, like, and he packs his own rounds. Oh yeah. He makes yeah. his own grain, and he does he does his own everything. Yeah. And they probably got thirty guns between the two of them. Right. And then I got another buddy that you know has a bunch of artillery ready to rock. Like, yeah. Yeah. So just, yeah, I wouldn't mess with Americans on you can, know. I mean, can you imagine somebody invading? Just say. You know, South, you know, or East, or yeah, East Georgia. Say they came ashore East Georgia, and because of Georgia, I'm calling out Georgia because that's where we're, we're at. Yeah, that's uh, where we live. All yeah. right. So they come up, they come on shore, and they get on shore, and these guys they're carrying maybe 150 rounds or 200 rounds a piece. Well, guess what? The first. First wave they hit, they're gonna hit some rednecks that got a thousand rounds in their basement, oh, yeah. Yeah. and then they're they're carrying two hundred fifty rounds with them. Right, you know, right, right. so I mean, come on, you're gonna get that first two, you know. And believe me, these guys know how to shoot. Oh yeah, they yeah. they yeah. are shooting deer at three hundred yards. Oh, God, you know, yeah. Yeah. with accuracy. I have a friend with a seven thousand dollar deer hunting gun. 
that but sh- it shoots up to over a mile away yeah wow. you know like it's, yeah, it's, it's they're a mile away and we, this guy just picked off a hundred of them before yeah. they even got a half a mile from him <laughs> like, you know he's like oh there's no okay yeah another one, another one, no. another one. Right. you know come on we gotta protect ourselves that's i mean for sure and, and we don't get into politics on this show. No, right, right. No but politics. there is, there is the second the amendment. Right. You know, yep. and it's the most beautiful thing. That and these liberals, had. since we're not going to talk about them, but we got to talk about them, are trying to take that away from us. So yes. watch who you put in yes. office. <laughs> since we're not going to be political, yeah. watch the liberals. I'm yeah. going to go ahead and say that yeah. out loud. Watch you, the liberals. You, you are exactly <laughs> right. Yes. And yes. guess what? You, you finished your last drip beer? Uh, no, I got one in the fridge. Oh, can you, I, can yeah, I, go, yeah, go ahead. Go, okay, I'll be it. back, guys. I'll be back. Yeah, we're going to drink to that. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Cheers. 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 I mean, usually we'd shot, you know, if Burroughs yeah. was yeah. here. Or that if that guy was here, we'd yeah. take oh. a shot. And <laughs> both <laughs> times them two have been on this show. It has been the I most mean, drunken moment. It is. Come on, Bill. Bill. And, 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 yeah. And that guy, yeah, and that, oh, guy, that guy, Bill, okay. that guy, like, be, like, they argued for a good fifteen minutes on the show, and Correct. then a good thirty minutes after the show about <laughs> about going on a hike. <laughs> it, it was just hilarious. Uh, and yeah. then uh, I'm mean, even gonna say it because I so told you we're not gonna talk about it. Oh yeah, yeah. we're not gonna talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> new subject, yeah. new subject. Better but, subject. But, but we did argue about going on that hike. And okay. then the last episode, it just got wild here. Yeah, yeah. Like it was an there was an after party. We'll say that. Okay, okay. You know things were broke. Yeah. Um, people did some stuff. You know, it, it, it was not. It was, things were broke. Things. What do they just, call it? Yeah. Uh, sh- uh, shenanigans. Uh, shenanigans. There was shenanigans <laughs> and many shenanigans. What, what's up. funny is I bailed out because I I was. You had enough. I had enough. Like I couldn't um I couldn't get out of my bathroom long enough. So, <laughs> oh Lord. You know I, yeah. I was uh, I was done. Done. Ta- hey, tap but, out. Tap out. But yeah. then <laughs> poor old Stormy was taking care of everybody. Okay. Okay. She oh, yeah, was, that's your soon to be significant other. Yes. So give yes. her give her a mention, sweet Stormy. Yeah, yep. <laughs> you know, um, if you want to come support the wedding, you know, April 6, 2024. So. Yeah. Happy, the, by uh, the way, if you're going to have a By the way, go ahead. Huh. Happy birthday, Stormy. Oh, yeah. Oh, it will be her is. birthday on uh, this uh, coming week. When this comes out, it'll, it, be, it, they'll, it'll be her birthday. She'll be happy another year birthday old. to you. So, yeah. Stormy, happy birthday, girl. Yeah. So, so it turns out, turns out that, uh, me and Bayless over here are about the same age. We've Correct. Been, we've May been around 7th. the world about the same many. I got him by two months. I'll two be months. Dang. Yeah, yeah. That's crazy. I'm your senior. Remember that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> <laughs> two months. What was so, I doing? I was so, like pooping in my diaper before so, we got out. Of that. Papa, and I was already. Papa re- Bayless uh, yeah. over there. Yeah. You know? <laughs> That's right. That's right. Gotcha. So you want to get your own call me out like that? That's huh? okay. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, hold on. Let's look at the beard. <laughs> I, I use. Uh, I look, use. Look just, at that beard. I use just for men. Because <laughs> <laughs> right here it gets gray. You need a little bit more. I need more. <laughs> I've I'll never it touched when I get it. home. <laughs> <laughs> I've never used it. So yeah, just yeah. Let well, you right know. here, this is all natural, so there's not a lot there. But right here, I don't know why this little part tries yeah, to. No, yeah, no. I yeah. the, the the older I get, the darker my hair gets. But my my beard's gr- red as yeah, yeah, red as can be. Well, you wear it well. Looks I good appreciate it. Yeah, it looks good on. I, I didn't grow be, I wasn't able to grow this until I got out of the military, and then I just you Oosh. know. I just, you know, I, I don't want to shave no more from yeah, shaving exactly. every day to yeah, yeah. not shaving a day in my yeah. life. So for about fifty years, I did. I had a clean face. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I'd wear a mustache. Something told me to do the beard, and I'm very comfortable with it. Now. Yeah, wow. yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's something about manhood um, that we can have our wild looking face, and I think women kind of like it. It gives us the masculine. Yeah. So yeah. you know, I've had a few compliments, one or two, hopefully. So yeah, we just we're gonna you roll think with they it. were compliments. Yeah, you know. we're gonna roll with it. We're gonna roll with it. We're so hiding the ugly. It, so, the more hair you grow, that you hide the ugly. So. Right, and that's that's why I grow it. 
A whole point behind it. Yeah. My, my my lovely wife, by the way, I tried to grow a beard and she wouldn't let me. Uh uh-uh. uh. No, no. I tried it. And she wouldn't let me. But I grew my goose. I, Go I always had a porn stash. I, oh, I yeah. Mean, yeah, 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 yeah. No, the yeah. Thicks, Ron Jeremy. Yeah, 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 I mean, I had it. But I started getting a little older, and I started having this double chin. She wanted to hide, and, hide, and hide it. it. And, you and I grew my goatee, and yeah. I'm like, oh, I can't even see my goat. My goat, <laughs> <laughs> my goat neck. <laughs> my goat neck. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm it ain't you. there no more. Bye. So. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> and I know it's old, older people always get the fatter faces yeah. and the oh, big yeah. necks and the yeah, shit. Yeah. It, it um, does slenderize us. You know, it gives so, us a little distinguished yeah, look in the old rate. So. We're going to run with you it, know, baby. We're going to run with it. That, that, it's a funny because like you, uh, they've done like these pictures of basketball players that have beards and stuff correct and then they do these edits where they shave them off and they look horrible horrible yeah, yeah. you're yeah. like oh my god that's a person yeah. <laughs> yeah. throw that shit back yeah yeah Qu- quick quick yeah. <laughs> i wonder if it would fix some women oh, i don't no. think so huh? no <laughs> nah they should probably not grow no more no but face. makeup oh, does man. a wild thing oh I'll tell god you that. i've seen some bearded women and they're scary oh. <laughs> 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 Come see the bearded lady. <laughs> Where's my gold? <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, wow. uh, Damn it, man. Hey, uh, we love all women. Yes. Of wa- walking, you know. Yeah. Any any woman that walks this earth, we love you all. We that did, was born we, a woman. Yeah, yeah. Real, oh, yeah. Re- real we women. We will say that. We, we will, can yeah, definitely we can say go that. there. Yeah. Real women, we love you. Yes. 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 Okay, that's good for me. I'm yeah. on that one. Ah, Cheers again like on that. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're yes. not who you Drink identify that. as. Yes. Who you are, who God made you. Yes. Women, we love you, women. <laughs> that's funny because uh, so on Amazon, there's a, like a clothing, a shirt that they were selling, and it said male or female on there. Because there's only two genders. Thank you. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That is it. <laughs> that is it. <laughs> <laughs> so like we're not gonna pretend for no, you no <laughs> no biology 101 Thank biology you. 101 there it is so uh, and then on one of my uh podcasts i used to watch they said uh they got a thing where like they were talking about gendered language and this guy goes on this uh interview and he says do not talk about gendered language yeah <laughs> like, yeah, well, yeah no <laughs> So he's talking about like the the pronouns and so oh, yeah. make sure you use your pronouns when you talk about a certain person. Clownish, clownish like, thoughts. Like this stuff is ridiculous. Yeah. Yes, it's really and, and, ridiculous. And, to and push by the it way, on somebody is ridiculous. Yes. By the way, Dave Bayless. Yes. Uh, assumes the pronoun of the clown. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and so he wants to be the clown. Of I the am crowd. the clown. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so I tell am. tell us a little story about being about you clowning around. Uh, that's every day of my life. Yeah. Uh, any opportunity I have to make a joke, I will be the brunt of that joke just to make people laugh. Oh, I, I love that. I, oh, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Look here, I am very humble, and I enjoy to get a reaction out of people. And uh, you know, Chris Farley said that I think one yeah. time about yeah. that, anything you know anything yeah. for a laugh and. That I'm right here. So, I'm that guy. Anything it, for a laugh. I want to keep it light. I want to lift people up when they're down. I want to make you smile all the time. That's you know, that's it, that's my goal is to make you happy and make myself happy. Going, We're all gonna be happy. Going off of that, yeah, so we've yeah. done some TikTok videos. Okay. Me and him and which anything we, for a joke. We dude, we, we stopped and we need to get back on it. But we yeah. he's at the thing where he says that's why I'm the dad. Count yeah. me in on it, y'all's next. Because yeah. I'll, I'll do like, anything for a clown show. So like yeah, I I'm, always I'm play. The, I literally play a dumbass. Okay. Like, like easy. I, it seems easy, right? Uh, yeah, it, it's great. <laughs> no. I mean, Hold I up. Love it. Hold up, Ben. <laughs> okay. You're not always playing. <laughs> <laughs> I just tell you you're smart <laughs> because I'm the dad. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. But that's his line. So okay, like, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Cool. cool. We haven't done it in a long while. We really should get back on it. But we we made some great great videos. We, yeah. 
I mean, not very many, but we had like 5,000 views on one right, of them right, and stuff right. like that. But Well, I'm anything. The, I'm a clown show walking. Um, so like if, I'm with y'all if you want. So if you, if you want to look up Intoxicated Logic Talks TikTok. Right. Yeah. You know, yeah. Check you, us out. Yeah, please. we're going to check there's that some, out. There's some funny videos nice. on there. Yeah. Hey, you guys it, have been doing this, what, uh, over a year? Am I uh, right? Right, right, right about a year. That's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So this yeah. is the beginning. I love being on the yeah. foundation with you. Yeah. 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 Good deal. So. If Dave Bayless has any friends out there watching this, please subscribe to this channel. Please do. These guys yeah. are fun yeah. right now. Fun, fun, fun. We're here on a Sunday afternoon yeah. and enjoying life. Yes. That's yes what I mean, that's and that's, that's what, it's what it's all about. Yeah, and this is this too right here is pure entertainment. <laughs> I Am I wrong? <laughs> I, I mean, no, no. I got an audience of two. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'll have to agree. Uh, Man. And we would also like to say, Dave, Dave Ballas, he's going to send us a video. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I do and, karaoke. I sing a karaoke. That's my deal. Four nights a week. And I do probably 100 different songs. And I just, I love music that much. I get out there and do my little singing. I don't have a band, but I love what I do. And I enjoy, we do weddings and parties, stuff like that. But mainly just singing at the local places. Uh, Lee Pub, uh, again, Harvest Moon. I go over to Mellow Mushroom. Uh, also, I don't want to mention uh, Billy Joe's. Billy Joe's does it on Friday night. So really? yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's carry a uh, roosters, roosters on Wednesday and uh, third Wednesday and Saturday. I'm sorry, uh, Herb. How you doing, Herb? Herb's good uh, DJ. He oh, hosted. okay. Yeah. He, he, Mark Bullard. I got to mention Mark Bullard. That's my brother. Uh, he's in that Cut and Run band. Yeah, that's his yeah. band. That Mark, band. That band. That, that band. band. <laughs> Not that sure. man, but that well, man. I, and I, he does Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. I might uh, Mark, have to talk Mark to Bullard. that band. I might have to talk to that band and see if I can get those guys on here. But yeah. Oh, yeah. Because they would be very intoxicated. Oh, man. Oh, could, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, over the top. Oh, yeah. Over the we top. We could get some intoxication So, so maybe I should on. take my shower curtain back down. Uh, yeah. yeah, take your shower curtain <laughs> and maybe set up an outdoors bathroom for that <laughs> Instead of letting them use your indoors bathroom. Right, right. <laughs> because, I mean, even though Bill and that guy yeah. would was bad, yeah. those two, if you get those two over here, yeah. oh, my God. Ed Lockmiller is Kenny, their bass player. Yeah, Lo you know, Ed, Ed Lockmiller. Ed, yeah. Yep. But get Kenny Spivey. Mark Bullard up in here. Oh, it'll be a show. Uh, I don't know if done. we could get Mark Bullard to talk, but Kenny. Yeah, will, you can. Mark's Kenny, Kenny will ramble on about whatever. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he'll, he'll just talk and talk. Well, he Marcus, won't know what he's talking about, but he'll talk. You know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Mark is a hell of a showman. I, I no, you, Mark is great, man. and he's so he versatile is. with his yes. voice. Yeah. Yes. Very yeah. talented. Like I said I just I could go on and on about all the bands around this area. So bringing up that, yeah. Um. So I wasn't around this town when you were bringing the local scene. Correct. But I'm going to call out the Oglethorpe. Yeah. Alice McCorkle. Absolutely. Love Alice her. McCorkle. One of the best singers in Albany, Georgia, Allison. Yeah. Um, she brought in uh, another wave of local talent. Right. And that's the talent in this town that I That you're I, familiar I, with, yes. I'm familiar yes. with. Yes. All those guys that came through there, that's where I came. I met all – I met – uh, that guy. I think that's the first place I saw you was at the Oglethorpe. Pro probably. probably so. Yeah. You know yeah. what? The Oglethorpe is big, you know, as small as it is. Right. That was the local musician hub. Meet. Little hub. The hub, right. the hub yeah. of I mean, musicians. I Alice, agree. Allison gave the little guys yeah. a chance I to think take it. They, they take took over home. where I had shut down in 2000. Yeah. yeah. So that's 100% the baton was passed that way. Right. Yeah. And, I agree. And it's, it happened after your era. Yeah. But then she brought it back. And right. she helped out the town. A lot of locals, yeah. yes, yes. yes. And yep. um, and and it, now it's starting to slip a little bit. I, I'm sure we there's some young it people up, up we there. Gotta, it needs it needs some breath of life we, to be We need yeah. need somebody to yeah. come in uh, and just yeah, open some talent. kind of venue that yeah. wants to bring in a little bit of talent. You know, it ain't like you said earlier. Right. It ain't all about making money. No. I'm at the point that I got to pay for all the bases I buy because yeah. I buy a lot of bases. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, but yeah. I mean, I got to pay for those Correct. things somehow. Yeah. So I, I mean, that's what I do. You know, yeah. I make yeah. a little money and pay for my Absolutely. equipment. But the the little guys, they go out to the pawn shop, buy their bass. Yep. They buy their guitar. Yep. And they want to get out and, and express. Yep. Exactly. Themselves, exactly. You know? Exactly. And um. 
a shout out to somebody that might want to just try to do something small. Yeah. Let's do it. You yeah. know, yeah. I'll come help you out if you need it. Yeah. You know, we definitely got all the equipment to help. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I could donate you enough equipment to do a sound system in any bar right now. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. yeah. You know, my I, thought, and this is just like a kind of a little small dream seed that I've got in my head is do like a Dave Palooza, not to be the ego, but I just want to do four or five local bands let's just get together in a field and jam so i've actually had the idea of we so, ain't got to name it dave palooza that's just me saying but <laughs> it, uh, we can call it whatever if, we want if to. we book it and they come it's yes. dave's palooza uh, there you go <laughs> there so, you go there you so go. but like i just want to be the clown <laughs> let me be the clown we started, and y'all do the music we started, yeah. <laughs> and you do the you do the sound and yeah i do all the tech technical. you're technical i'm yeah, the tech yeah. guy so. clown guy we got a circus we got a circus we got a circus yeah hell yeah hell yeah <laughs> but uh like so <laughs> i um i had the idea of that too like with yeah. this podcast i was like man once we get big enough a live podcast. And we're gonna, boom. We're gonna no. do a live show. Okay. With all the bands playing. No. There you, there you go. That's show. that. that and we're gonna set this table up right here. Yeah. Off to the side. Right. So and we're that, gonna be talking. We're gonna do a, a like a, a like Howard Stern yeah. podcast concert. You know, we're gonna talk a little bit. Have yeah. that artist come talk to us. Yeah. And then and now y'all go out there and jam. Now, now y'all go play. Hell yeah. 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 Boom. We just need the field, Boom. field or That's whatever. That's a home run. I mean, it, so. I think we could do that. You just hit a grand somewhere. slam. You just yeah. hit a grand slam. I yeah. mean, I really think we Great could do idea. it. Great you know? idea. I love the, I love the whole concept. Yeah. We're making it personal, and it's going back to my living room concert. Yes. 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 No. Yeah. Yeah. The setting. Like, so, you're comfortable. Mm -hmm. Here we are. Now go jam for us. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. I love we'll it. we get the whole, the whole band over here. Yeah. To talk to me and Ben. Let them and express themselves express before they themselves. go play. Right. Yeah, yeah. And, I uh, applaud you, sir. Yes. Yeah. So the, it's We've the really idea. Yes. So hopefully Beautiful one day idea. we can get yeah. it actually yeah. together. You plant the seed, you water it, and watch it grow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There you go. There you I go. don't know if we can make any money. So, all right, I got to tell you. We get promoters. Uh, Listen to me, I'm a salesman. That's what I do. So I'll go out and promote it, get advertisement money together so we got us a little nest egg to work off of I'm, so it makes things run smoother I even think, though you own everything you i think we're gonna do this yeah. ben we're gonna do this i'm gonna start talking to the bands yeah there's labette there's a couple other bands i want to get neon warlords on oh yeah, yeah they're great War, yeah oh yeah, yeah. Um, well, we put on a mega show. I, oh, I mean, God, yeah. if we could talk Bodine yeah. into coming on, yeah. if we get six or seven bands. And just blow it out. Yeah. I mean, they're, now the people are coming to see the band play one or two songs. Right. You know, so because we can't have it go on too long. Yeah. You know, but a four hour night, if oh, we yeah, could get beautiful. seven bands in. Yeah, in that's perfect. Night, yeah. yeah. You know, have, um, do your tw best. Tw 20 minutes. Seven sets. songs. Yeah. Yeah. Do your best seven. 20, yeah. 30 minutes. You know, don't you, I want your best seven. And then you do your best seven. You do your best seven. And yeah. then just make it flow. And then it's yeah. not overkill and everybody leaves yeah. excited and happy. I, yeah. I might even cut that down to like three. Yeah. Okay. Know? Whatever you because, whatever you set up. Because yeah. we, we're going to be setting up and we want to do seven or eight bands. Yeah. In right. Night. Yeah. yeah. And mm -hmm. it needs to flow pretty right, good. You right. Know? Right. Mm -hmm. um, and have it early enough to where. The older group can get in and get out, and they don't feel like they're out there till midnight because nobody's gonna stay. No, right. no. Yeah, so it's right. gotta be fresh. No, this is yeah. gonna be yeah. on a weekend day, yeah, yeah. Saturday. Yeah, but... yeah. Early enough where you yeah. get out there and you get your jam going on and get the flow, and then, and like I said, you know, nine nine thirty, you're done, and everybody's yeah. happy. Leave happy. Yeah, and now, safe. Now I do want to put out. You guys yes. heard it here first, so don't steal correct my idea. Yeah, well, it doesn't matter if they oh, try. Well, they can't <laughs> do it. So, <laughs> so hey, ben, hey, they can't. They can't. Often imitated, but never duplicate. They can't. No. They can't duplicate can't us. No, no, we no. are us. It's the real know? deal. It's the real we know deal. them. We can book them. Yeah, and we can do it. The connection. You've already got the seeds oh, yeah. planted. It's done. Been watered. Definitely. Now it's ready to grow. Yeah. Hell yeah. 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 I mean, so this could be something that's uh, you know. Covers something from original to cover. Sure. Cover sure. Yeah, yeah. Sure. You know. Going to get one more Bud Zero. Oh, uh, yeah. Help yourself, Bud. Right. We're just going to sit here and punch each other in the arm. <laughs> um, Budweiser Zero, if you will sponsor me, uh, I drink these regular. Just send me as many cases as you can. If you need my address, I'll gladly give it. <laughs> <laughs> Budweiser Zero. <laughs> 
Bud, Budweiser, if you sponsor him, I will start. <laughs> I will start drinking the real Budweiser. <laughs> there you go. There you go. I'm just. I'm just telling you that right now. I've been. I've been plugging yeah. Jim Beam ever since we started doing Not this show. Not a word show. from him. Not a, Not word, a word from him. From him. Okay. Assholes. Well, this is delicious. It has the flavor of a full beer. Uh, no sugar and no alcohol, and it is delicious. Mm. That's and, my plug. And, <laughs> and, I do and, love it. I mean, as far as it relaxes me. It does, yeah. I get a nobody's ever called Dave Bellis a uh, lightweight, but a non-alcoholic. Mm, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they think he's drunk every time. Every they time, see him. I'm just a loud guy. I can't, hey, I'm either wide awake or sound asleep. There is no in between with me. So I'm just me. I'm just a loud guy. <laughs> when, when Dave shows up, you know the party just started. It's just getting started, baby. That's right. <laughs> oh, shit. Wow. Sorry. I'm having fun with you guys, man. This is just like, it's comfortable. Uh, I got two great guys right here, full of positive energy. If you see these guys on the streets, give them a hug, man. They're great. They really <laughs> yeah. are. They deserve a hug. Stormy, give that man a hug. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> yeah. Oh, when's the wedding? Uh, 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 April 6, 2024. Okay, okay. So we got a little time. We're going to be So there. there's yeah. time, and I, I've been talking about it, and I was like, you know what? I I feel bad because we're about to have, like, all the bands at our wedding. Yeah. So on that Saturday, I'm sorry for all the bars. Yeah, Because yeah. they're all oh, going to be at my wedding. Man. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. So, we're, so my idea, and it's still in the talks, is to set up the stage. 95 is playing at my wedding. Correct. 95 uh, is going to play. Yeah. So, but I still want the stage set up. So if any other bands want to go up and play some so music at the wedding. let me ask you. So 95 is going to be there set up and playing. But can, like. Cameos happen? Oh, cameos, Commerce Child. You know, I mean, look, after, child, look I I'm going to put it this way. I mean, you know. I mean, Stormy might not be on the same page as I am, but after the ceremony, yeah. it's a fucking party. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a full No holes barred. It's ah, a party. Yeah. And, like, I mean, the the people who can't handle it will probably leave. Exit but, to the rear. But uh, <laughs> we're going to, me and her are going to be partying. Yeah, and, well, it's your celebration we, well, of life. Well, after last night, you know, Stormy's got a limit. Oh, God. Oh, oh hold oh, up. Oh, she oh, has a here. limit. Let's she, hear this story now. She, hold on. So, I want to hear Oh, no. So, no, yesterday, so <laughs> well, she went out and she drank wine all day long with her family. Day drinking? Like, day drinking. Yeah. And shopping out in America. Oh, nice. They went to America's day drinking. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> me, I, I went and picked her up in America and then drove all the way to Baxley. Yeah, yeah. And uh, she was just, she was tired. At right, right. 11.30, she was like, I, I can't I got to lay down. Yeah, she, yeah. She the wine dying. had got that thing. The wine had gotten her. So, <laughs> so well, and, yeah. and, and she started whining. Huh? The, wine at, uh, the wine after the wine. The wine after the wine. <laughs> really, there was no wine. She just went straight to sleep. Oh, okay, it was, good. It was good. good. Yeah. But you had her safe, so oh, that's yeah. all that matters. Yeah, yeah, no. I good. had her good. Good, good, good. She that was the first night though she did have to go lay down. So I give her props. She she day drinked and then tried to hang on and she just Oh, that's a it. tough road. Yeah. 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 Yep. Yep. We all got our limitations for yeah. sure. So uh Hell but, yeah. yeah, man. This has been a great podcast. I've thoroughly uh, enjoyed our conversation. Hell yeah. yeah. We've we've done a good show today. Uh Dave Bayless. Thank you for having Thank, me, brother. Yeah, I yes, thoroughly sir. enjoyed it. Yep. Yes, sir. Uh, everybody out there, uh, this is my son right here, Ben. I love him. And he has nothing good to say about me ever. Oh, <laughs> we know better. <laughs> know better. He's you a know, great, you know, here, I'll say something. You're a great bass player. <laughs> He's lying to you. <laughs> I fake it a lot. I have fun. Yeah. But yeah. You're good. And then if you're, if you're listening, Looking to try to promote music, give it Dave. I love Send him music. your stuff yep, and let yeah. him hear it. Yeah. Yeah. He'll get let, you out there. Let's just keep rock and roll alive. Rock that that roll. is my message. I'm, I'm rock and be, roll live forever, brother. I'm not going to be you know, like that. I love rock and roll. Believe yeah. me. All music. But all music. All you know, music. Yeah. Uh, as far as hip hop, I mean, come yeah. on. yeah, Anything, anything local, you guys just... 
support it. Yeah. Give a good message. If you're yeah. going to do hip hop and, and that's your genre and that's what you want to do, give a good message. Let yeah. these young kids and let these people be hear, be right. positive with it. Don't, don't have everything with guns, shooting, and drugs, and, and, no, and hookers. Here, and give them a good message. That's what I say. Here's another good, good, good local group. Okay. Unbreakable Bloodline. Bloodline, yeah. John, these John. guys fucking give that positive, yeah, positive yeah. message. They probably, their kids that don't love them yeah. probably shouldn't watch our show. Yeah. I, I saw <laughs> I saw John Smith last night at the Tribute Man. He and was there. He, he was at the Led Zeppelin. Yeah. I was okay. And he gets wife, all John. over the place. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. yeah. It was yeah. good to see John yeah. Smith. Yeah. Good to see you and your wife, your lovely wife. Yes. But, but um, th- those guys, you know, are, are a great band. And they they work so freaking hard. Yeah, you know I haven't heard but, them play in a while, but they got high energy. Yeah, no, they oh, yeah. Yeah. they yeah. do. Again, yeah. it goes to the mass amount of talent around the Albany area. Yes. Okay, Lee County, uh, Worth County, uh, what have you? Just our general, yeah. our general yeah. hub around here. There's a lot of talent. And it's amazing not, talent. It's not, not just not, average. Not it's average. not something that's just happened <laughs> over time. No, either. been here. I mean. Ray Charles came from there this very go. town. There you go. Yeah. There you you go. know, I mean, yeah. come on. It's got to be something in the water. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully yeah. it's not the Flint River water because yeah, we know what's in there. Don't we know what's the in the Flint River. In the Flint. <laughs> I don't. Do not drink your local water. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> we we love you. Hey hey. And we will see you next time. And subscribe to this channel if you get this far in this podcast. Woo! Hey guys, take care. All right. Uh, because we're going to drink to that, what you just said. Yep. <laughs> oh, shit. Mm. <laughs>